Grace and peace be with you all. Let's hear words from Psalm 27, verses 4 through 5. One thing I have desired of the Lord, that I will seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord, and to inquire in his temple. For in the times of trouble he shall hide me in his pavilion. In the secret place of his tabernacle he shall hide me. He shall set me high upon a rock. You know, it's not always as bad as it, as it seems. The news today always has information about the coronavirus. Tensions in the Middle East, the, the market going up and down, natural disasters in the southeastern U.S. Um, it's a time of trouble, yes, but sometimes it's not as bad as it seems. Let me, let me, let me illustrate by, by telling you a story. Out in the West, a cowboy was driving down the road. And he took a curve a little too fast and rolled over his truck. Well, in the truck bed, he had his faithful dog, and in the trailer behind the truck, he had his prize horse. Well, the accident was, a, was an awful mess, and, and eventually a state trooper came pulling up, and he got out and... He was a great lover of animals, and he realized the uh, the accident was was pretty bad, and, and rushed back to where the horse was. And after examining the horse, realized his injuries were so severe that he pulled out his service revolver and put the animal out of his misery. As he walked around the vehicle, he came across the dog, and. The dog, too, was critically wounded, winding and, and, and in great pain. So again, the officer put the dog out of his suffering. Finally, the officer located the cowboy, who had suffered multiple injuries, um, could barely breathe, had cuts in, in, all, all over his body, and uh, looked at him and said, Are you okay? Well, the cowboy took one look at the uh, smoking gun in the trooper's hand and quickly replied with an unexpected amount of energy, Never been better. You know, we're all pilgrims together in this, in this journey and, and these un, unknown times. Um, but we always have the promise of God. God will protect us and, and, and keep us. So when the world approaches us and, and we're not sure what's going to happen, try to find the strength to say, I've never been better. Because with God, we have never been better. One thing I have of the Lord that I will seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all of my days. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, as we conclude this, this time of Lent and, and, and look to Holy Week, we're going to relive and remember the entry into Jerusalem, people shouting Hosanna. But over the course of the week, those shouts will turn to crucify him. And then Christ will give himself on the cross. But that's not the beginning. That's, that's not the end. That's only the beginning. Christ will be raised from the dead. And in, in him and his resurrection, we can say that we have never been better. Amen. Go in peace, stay healthy, and I look forward to seeing you again soon. God bless. Thank <laughs> you.